gallbladder is a hollow, pear-shaped organ which is attached to the posterior inferior surface of right lobe of liver. It's a distensible sac that may contain 30 to 50 milliliters of bile. Bile is formed in liver, then passed by biliary tract to the gallbladder, where it's concentrated. Gallbladder's main function is storage and subsequent bile release during the process of digestion. The main function of bile is lipid emulsification which is a breakdown of lipid globules into smaller droplets. It's important because it provides a larger surface area, which the enzyme pancreatic lipase can act on. Furthermore, bile plays a role in excretion of waste products of metabolism, for instance, conjugated bilirubin. Wall of gallbladder comprises three layers, mucosa, muscular layer, and serosa or adventitia. Adventitia is located on the side which faces the liver. Mucosa is composed of two layers, epithelial lining and lamina propria. It forms variable branching folds which are more prominent when the gallbladder is not distended. Folds are different from villi which are situated in the small intestine. The difference between these two is that folds interconnect and branch. We lie, don't. Folds sometimes look like little monsters. Mucosa forms deep outpouchings which penetrate into the muscular layer or even through it. They are called Rakitansky ask of sinuses. Their presence is not considered pathological but they might be associated with gallstones, cholecystolithiasis. Epithelial lining is composed of simple columnar epithelium. Epithelial cells are rather tall, reaching up to 50 micrometers, which makes the gallbladder epithelium the highest simple epithelium at all. The cells have abundant but short microvilli, and small apical mucus granules. These cells secrete mucus, which protects the mucosa from harmful effects of bile, and they also are able to transport ions and water, thus partaking in final composition of bile. Lamina propria consists of loose connective tissue, it can contain tubular mucus secreting glands, which are prominent in the gallbladder neck, near the end of cystic duct. We can't see them in our section, because it was not performed in this region. Muscular layer is thin and circular, containing smooth muscle cells. Serosa is composed of loose connective tissue with abundant adipocytes covered by simple squamous epithelium called mesothelium. Loose connective tissue of serosa is rather thick, and that's why a layer between muscular layer and serosa called subserosa is described in some textbooks. There are big vessels, which are branches of cystic artery as well.